it's time for the final battle. Will, will I get ba Baby Luigi? Found tonight on Dragon Ball Z. The final battle is commencing. Those yellow eyes are. You, you're not welcome here, Yoshi. All right, all right, baby. Look at baby Bowser, isn't he so cute with his big nose? Gimmick, it's noisy in here. I wanna go sleepy by yeah, I do too, baby Bowser. I do too. Wah. I'm gonna You change from goo ha 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 to I wanna go sleepy by. <laughs> huh? Hmm? Baby this shows baby Bowser's dumbness. What kind of green donkey is that? Looks wanna what looks like fun. He want he, me wanna ride. Mine, mine, mine. Okay, this fight. Do not let him do that. Okay, this is basically the battle of the butt stop. Okay, never mind. You do actually hear the boss name. It's the Battle of the Butt Stomp. Except I never do it right. I never do it right. There you go. Get him three times in. Well, this battle is pretty simple. So I never do this right. Yeah, if he lands on you, of course, as we all know, Baby Bowser will be on your back, and well, that's sort of simple. This is the last time you ever hear this name. I would demonstrate that, but I'm not going to. There we go. See, it's really simple. That that fight's really simple. Just have to time your blessed on correctly. Yoshi, why'd you do that? Young oh, and also, this is the first This is the first time I ever play as... You don't play as purple Yoshi, you play as green Yoshi. Now, this battle is epic. Now, this battle is so freaking epic. He makes baby Bowser go huge. I like, I like the fact that it's like a playpen. I like, I like how it's doing as a playpen. It's sort of interesting. And, and we never really know baby Bowser's parents or whatever. It's just like... Seems like he's an orphan or something, and Kamek's is just like his nurse, or, or maybe Bowser's ba daddy Bowser and Mama Bowser never existed. Who knows? But this battle's epic. I like this battle. This battle's awesome. <laughs> he's giant Bowser. Looks like regular Bowser, except he still has the big nose. And this boss makes awesome. Dun, dun, dun. I just turned up for you guys. Dun, dun, dun. Yes. If he gets closer to you, if he gets really close to you and all those things get destroyed, you're screwed. And he has a radical. See, even he's like, like two scan radicals, but I can. This, now, I just like the way for him to get a little bit closer because it's hard to. Mode so that's finest. Let's put him on his nose. That big nose of his. I'm using timing and patience. See, it's really hard to hit him unless he's like really close. I don't think I've ever been able to hit him when he's like very far away. And when he gets really close to you, you're dead. What the hell? Oh, I hit I hit one of his one of his minions. I hit one of his toadies. What the hell? Why am I not hitting him? I hit him I'm supposed to hit him on his head, but he's not hitting. There we go, I hit him. That's one of the more annoying things. The Bowser fights are really annoying because one, the butt stomp never actually works properly, and two, it's hard to hit him when he's hit him when he's big. That's pretty much the main reason why these fights are kind of annoying. They're easy, but they're annoying because of bad game game design. Because it's really hard to hit him. That's pretty much it. Because you gotta aim this right. See, it's like I throw it, I aim at his nose, but it's way too close. It's not close enough. But this buzz buzz bow music makes up for it. Oh, see, it goes way too far away. It went right over his head. <laughs> there you go, hit him on the nose. I think I want to hit him three more times. Uh-oh! When he gets really closer, you are dead. And I mean it, you are dead. You are dead. You are dead, you are dead. Let me see how much awesome this music is. It's up there with the... Okay, it's on three, maybe it's six, I don't remember. Final bosses normally have more than... Uh-oh. He's summoning his tornado! Oh, God. See, when you have, like, only a little bit of platform left, this fight gets really annoying. Go die. <gasps> what the... Go over his head. What the hell was doing so well too? I was doing so well. I was doing well. Shut up. 
I just got screwed up. I got freaking screwed up because of small platforms. Uh oh. <gasps> Fuck you. Fuck you, baby Bowser, and your stupid fireball. I think he's dead. Oh, he's not dead. I think, I think it's six hits. It's six or seven. There you go, he's dead. It's seven hits. There you go, you saw me screw me once or twice due to the stupid platforms. But he's really easy. I am not a pro, so shut up. I am not a freaking pro at anything of normally obscurities. Baby Bowser has been defeated, and we won't see him again Super Mario Bros. 1. I don't care about the text. Yeah, if no one knows the actual story, ba Baby Mario is part of the Mushroom Kingdom. It's just after this, somehow, he was sent to Brooklyn. No, he was sent to our Earth, and he was born in Italy, and he was actually from the Mushroom Kingdom. He just doesn't remember. This is actually proves he's from the Mushroom Kingdom. It's Baby Luigi! We say Luigi and the Stork. When did they kidnap the Stork? I remember the intro movie that then the Stork fell. They never actually kidnapped the Stork. Da, da, thus, due to the malevolent... Levin's teamwork of, Yoshi, of the Yoshi clan. The twins are reunited. The captured stork is freed by Yoshi. Sets about his duties to finally make the long-awaited delivery. Thank you, Yoshi. The twins will meet the parents soon. And I am Dan Grease, the narrator of nothing. Well, that's it. That's the end of the Yoshi's Island playthrough. Um... Let's see, there's also, now you just have to see the final blow up. The final, final blow up. The final, final blow up. Oh god. It's all good. Okay, sorry. I knew it was gonna sneeze. Oh god, that was bad. Okay. Not very professional, like, am I? Okay. Now, the credits are really, really not really that important, just them flying around the sky. I'm going to fast forward it because I really want to get to the end, the end of the credits because this just basically going to be this all the way and it's really glitchy and I really just want to see the, the last part of it. So, let's do that. Yeah, all these people no one really fucking cares about. You can still read it, it's not really going that fast. Just the, the credits are really boring, I want to get to the end of the credits. See, all these people really. I, this game is actually really, really good. I mean, I, I, I recommend you play it. I recommend you really do play this game. I recommend if I know. It's, I, I think it's on the virtual console. No, I don't. I'm not sure. And this is really where my theory comes in that the parents of Mario and Luigi are Toad and Toadette. Really, it's just a really weird theory. But, um, yeah, that's about it for the Yoshi's Island playthrough at this part. Not really sure. I'm just. I'm also doing this so I can check to see if the if the secret levels are opened up after the credits. Come and check. After that, if they're not, then well, we're going to. Then well, I'm not going to do secret levels if they're on. It, it depends on if they're unlocked or not. If they're unlocked, I'll do them. If they're not unlocked, then I won't do them. So. Heroes are born. Yay, baby Luigi and Mario. That's so cute, on the baby Mario. The end. The end. The end. So I hope you've enjoyed the Yoshi's Island playthrough. Um, it was a great, it's a great game. I recommend you play it. If you like this playthrough, subscribe, watch the playlist, everything. I'm going to go ahead and um, check the thing. I, I might as well do that right now. I'll just reset it. Check and see if it unlocks unlocks the secret. Nope. The secret levels are not unlocked. I have to get 100% on every single level. So that's about. So that's how. That's the end of the Yoshi's Island playthrough. Um, no, I'm not doing secret levels. So that's about it. See you around, guys. Bye.